Hi, Honor Students, Dean Corvino here with our weekly video message. I wanna to talk to you about the power of costuming. Now, I'm not talking about Halloween, although I hope you had a fun one. I'm talking about the clothes that we wear to signal to ourselves and others how we wish to be understood. So, for example, today I had a video interview, and so I put on what I think of as my Dean clothes. I put on a suit and tie, lapel pin, puts me in a kind of Dean-like frame of mind, lets me know that I'm about to say Dean-like things, and lets other people know that that's the kind of person that I want to be understood as in that moment. When I get up in the morning, one of the first things I do is put on my gym clothes. That's a signal to myself that, okay, you're not just gonna go back to bed or get on the couch, you're gonna get your butt out of the house and go to the gym and work out. If there's a day when I'm planning on getting a lot of writing done, I'll put on very comfortable clothes, both as a way of telling me that, okay, you're gonna be sitting at your desk for a long time, so be comfortable. And also don't put on anything fancy because you're not going out to see people today. You need to stick by your desk and get your writing done. The point is that the clothes we wear not only signal to other people how we wish to be understood, but can really help put us in the frame of mind to do the things that we want to do. What are some of the ways in which you use costuming to your advantage, in which your clothes help put you in a frame of mind? As always, you can leave comments in the comments section and let us know. Good luck, and we'll see you soon.